we grew up in uh, in China. We're very picky about rice. So um, and after I came here, I realized maybe the, uh, the American market people are not fully aware of different varieties of rice with the difference between long grain, medium grain, short grain, and extremely ultra short grain. Um, the shape of each grain impacts so much up, uh, after cooking the, the rice taste and texture and also like which type of rice is best suited to which cooking method. I, I feel this is there's a there's a vacuum in the marketplace for that. So that's why like in at Zing Sao Some Rice we did a rice chart just to explain to people uh, why we pick the type of rice, rices. Well, we have straight rice, uh, medium grain sushi, white rice, uh, the medium grain uh, brown rice, and uh, purple rice, or people call it black rice or forbidden rice. Um, why we pick this straight rice? It, it's um, we pick the type of rice that can sustain a pan searing process well, and uh, also the kernels can be easily separated, um, not too sticky. So, like for example, for the white rice, I tasted at least 20 varieties from, uh, from what's available in grocery store, American markets, Korean markets, uh, Japanese market, Chinese markets, tested all these different brands. Eventually, we finalized um, just one variety. It's, it's Japanese seed but they grow in California. It's exactly the type of medium grain so that it's not, it's not as sticky as short grain sushi rice. But however, it's still very wrong, has that full like, natural sweetness to it. Um, so that's, and, and also it won't be easily like, get broken in the cooking process as, as compared to you know, Indian, the long grain rice or uh, Carolina rice. So that, that's that's how we finalize on this one.